What's up guys, this is Brad at Hourglass Fab. Anybody who has recently subscribed, I appreciate it very much. Thank you for following along. Today we're gonna be talking about a digital angle finder and how we're gonna use that to basically reference a zero point on anything round, like pipe, tube, or bar, so we can rotate that piece of pipe tube or bar at different degrees for drill locations or copes or whatever. Now most of the time we're gonna be doing this in a mill, but if you have a nice drill press with an XY table, that'll work as well. So let's jump into it guys and see what we can't do. This is some one and a half inch OD Schedule 40 6061 pipe. We're gonna jump over into Fusion 360 real quick, model up the part that I wanna show you. We'll put three holes in this piece of pipe, 120 degrees apart. As soon as we get that done, I'll meet you back here at the mill. This is the digital angle finder that we're gonna be using today. It does have a magnetic base, so you can stick that wherever you'd like. You can clock different angles on your bandsaw table. These things are great for clocking different angles when coping tube or bending tube. Today we're gonna to be using this to drill three holes 120 degrees apart, so let's jump into that. We got our piece of inch and a half OD schedule 40 aluminum pipe chucked up here in the vise. Clamp on digital angle finder, and I've already rotated that pipe back and forth to hit my zero degree mark on the digital angle finder. What we're gonna do now is use that reference to drill and locate our first hole, and then we'll rotate that to 120 degrees to drill our second. The angle finder is at zero degrees. We used an edge finder to find the center of our piece of pipe. Then we used a center drill and then a quarter inch drill bit to drill a hole through it and then chamfered that. Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna rotate this piece of pipe 120 degrees and then do the same process. So we're using these one, two, three blocks as a reference stop. We clocked this pipe 30 degrees past 90, giving us that 120 degrees spacing between hole centers. So as you can see, each one of these holes is 120 degrees apart. So sometimes it's tough to reference round tube pipe or bar like this and lay out dimensions on it if you need to do that. So I figured I'd share the digital angle finder with you guys and show you how easy it is to clock tube pipe or bar at whatever degree you need to locate a drill hole or a cope or a pocket or whatever on the mill. You can do it in a drill press as well if you have a nice X and Y vise. If you guys like this video, hit that like button for me. If you haven't subscribed already, do so. We'll have a lot of fun on this channel. I'd love to have you guys along. I appreciate it. I hope you took something from this tip and I hope you guys have a good day. We'll talk to you next time.